Oh, sorry, can you What on? are you doing? Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas! Welcome to Food Review UK. My name is MJ. My name is Father Cosmas. And I'm Nate Claus. And yeah, this is the first Christmas review of the year. Oh, Christmas seems to come earlier and earlier. It's not our fault, guys. What? Okay. Right. It's not our fault that we have to do... It's not our fault that Quality Street, Nestle, have released a brand new flavour of matchmakers in fucking August. And we and it's got gingerbread yeah, men on that Christmas. We did that last year. We had the same conversation last year when we tried the sorted caramel or whatever it was. And you were like, oh, matchmakers are like a Christmas thing and they released it early in that voice as well. <laughs> Is that and true? You, yeah, we've had this conversation. Are we just recycling old content consistently? I've got fucking Snickers in there, we'll have an argument in a minute, don't worry. Is this the bit where you edit in the footage of you having this conversation a year ago? Yeah. What on earth are Nestle thinking releasing matchmakers in May? It's a Christmas it's a product, Christmas you product, ignorant yeah. idiots. Oh, I just sort of smell mint. I just, really? I just, I just smell two overrated products combined together. Oh wow, wow. you're not a fan of. Uh... I find matchmakers completely overrated, and and, and gingerbread. Wow. Oh, smells quite interesting. Do you? No, mate. It smells like leather. You don't even want to try it. Yeah. It smells I, like. I will, because <laughs> will, yeah. it's a product I don't really want to, but I will try it. it smells like leather coconut. Yeah, it does actually. Smells like what? Leverkusen. Smells like Leverkusen. Smells like Bayern Leverkusen. Do you know who they are? Yeah, football. From where? Russia. <laughs> yep, sometimes when they play in Russia. Check out Michael Dem and Comedy for more hilarious banter like that. Hmm, quite nice. It's quite minty for me still. It's weird, isn't it? Yeah. There's a, yeah, it's not. I don't think it actually is. I think it's just, you've had so many mint ones in your life. Yeah, I don't find it meant to talk to you. Um, it's not too strong actually, it's quite nice. I must have just eaten a mint one that fell off the production line. From the, the conveyor belt above doing the mint one. <laughs> no, crossing over. <laughs> like um, in an animated movie. I think that's actually a game as well, isn't it? Dropping matchmakers. Um, yeah, the... The plank. Um, yeah. <laughs> Ka-chunk. Yeah. Um, they're quite nice. The packaging's really nice. Right, quite a bright ready orange, almost cocklicker. That looks good. Fair play. Uh, I got it from Tesco, by the way. It's two pounds. What did you compare them to? Leverkusen. What's that? What? What is it? What Leverkusen? Hmm. I thought you said that you agreed. And then proceeded to make a joke about Leverkusen. Yeah. Oh, well, you joking? You don't know what that is? Well, I think I know what it is, but I'd like you to explain to make sure that I do. They're the German spongy yeah, gingerbread yeah, covered yeah. in icing and chocolate. Definitely like that. I mean, that's a really astute observation to make, isn't it, when you've compared it to chocolate-coated gingerbread-flavoured products? I think that's a compliment. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Yeah, I stand by my... Sort of a shit product that I can't stop eating. Yeah, it's there. That's the problem with these products. They just yeah. sit there. Yeah, get you it end up eating them because they're there. Um, <clears throat> so messy. Yeah, gingerbread is not really a flavour I'd give a shit about. Wow. Matchmakers, I find an overrated product. Don't really like the texture, don't really like the flavour of the chocolate hugely. Um, it's not terrible. I'm sure you'll like it. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell, Grinch! Mid two. Um, I didn't get really any gingerbread from it, it was quite a little bit of subtle aftertaste but generally speaking it was just still quite minty wow. well, yeah it just wasn't obviously too dissimilar from a normal matchmaker like after eight sort of shit um, not that good yeah uh, mid mid two no high two yeah I guess I'm the guy who likes it the most and it's fine <laughs> it's pretty good what? Just as you have done on every review we've done tonight. We we're all sort of very consistent. Yeah? Yeah. You're probably going to give it a very high three. Oh. 
I think no. I'm low three. Yeah. Oh. Uh, not. I don't want to spoil it. I've got. No, I've got sorry. A yeah, a very low three. Yeah. I've got a bit of a bubble in my throat as well. Um, yeah, it's fine. It's normal matchmaker affair. Little shards of crystal that get fucking stuck in your teeth. Yeah. Uh, the chocolates fairly all right. Very unique tasting. Uh, and it's got yeah no I'll tell you the one takeaway from it is that the gingerbread is quite subtle it's not too strong and so that's the sort of the Leverkusen vibe which is sort of quite nice um, I'd give it a low three stars. <laughs> you, can't, you just can't not hear Leverkusen. Yeah. Oh, so that's football. Yeah, yeah. And they play in quiz. No, no, it's no, you. you're the quiz. Leverkusen, Poland, yeah, Germany. Yeah. Germany. What colours is their oh, kit? Originally, you mean? Y yeah. Because they played an away match. I mean, let's not compare the Germans that originally in were in Germany, but then uh, Poland. Oh, someone what? didn't watch their pre-season tour in Poland. Hmm. What colours mm. is their kit? The away or home? Home. Or third? Home. White. Home. White. No. Nope. Uh, I think you'll find white is in it. Uh, uh, oh, sorry, okay, who manufactures their kit? <laughs> uh, probably Adidas. Adidas. And Adidas's yeah. logo is... Probably stripes. Black. I mean, they're not... White. Only when they're on... Right, here's the Leverkusen kit. No, no, I was just about to bring it up on the phone. Okay. Well, it's... You don't need yeah, to... Yeah, do that then. Yeah. Leverkusen kit. There you go, it's got white in. Predominantly, oh, sorry. Predominantly white with blue and grey. Mm. Fair enough, we're completely wrong. Well, we're not completely wrong. Well, we're sort of wrong in the sense that they're because not Adidas anymore. What? There's some weird oh, ropey... Oh, Jacko. Yeah. Oh, sorry, what's that main colour in the middle where the logo is? <laughs> Why? What's, sorry, that's the main colour, is it? Not the huge the swaths of black. And red. Thank you so much for watching, guys. You should check out Michael Jameson Comedy. It's really, really funny. And follow us on Instagram at Fruckgram and listen to Fruck Unwrap, the Food Review UK podcast. I just accidentally farted. I've Goodbye. already done that twice. This video. But I didn't pass out this time, which is a plus Correct. in many ways.